And that's why it became Billy Idol. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, hi! Welcome to Pagefire. Three of... I'm good at throwing sunglasses. <laughs> uh oh. Owl? <laughs> Too cool for school. This is very, very disturbing. I'm gonna take them off. Anyway, here's Wonderwall. <laughs> <laughs> that landed on her toes. <laughs> I'm very impressed, honestly. I'm good at closing my legs. Anyway, like it's three. Good technique. Mm -hmm. Shut up on set! No. Fuck you. Anyway, at least four of you requested how to play Devian from How to Make Murder Folk, so we're gonna do that. And the gimmick for this episode, if I can teach him to play it, I can teach you how to play it. Howdy! <laughs> Howdy! I should've worn the hat. Oh, I want to show off my hair. I'm the one with the gracious hair now. Oh, guess one of us, one of us, one of us has to be the talent. <laughs> Me! <laughs> Clearly, Andrew, you're not the talent at speaking. <laughs> Hi, I'm Martin. From Pagefire. Yep, another Martin. <laughs> it doesn't get more confusing than that. Martin the Third. Twice removed. <laughs> Plus one. This song was actually written for one of my assignments at university, and I got a B for it. Uh, yeah, that's about it. A single B. A single Not B. enough to start a hive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, honey. Anyway, all the chords we'll be playing will be shown down below. And keep in mind, this song requires your guitar to be tuned in D standards. That's a whole tone down. We remember to tune the guitars first now. <laughs> yeah. Standard D. The first chord you need to learn is uh, let's see what's it? G minor. I like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The entire song is in G minor. And the beginning, be, begin, the, be, the beginning of the song <laughs> is uh, two chords. It's a G minor and D major. With a little variation, you use your pinky right here on the this this string. The B. The B tuned to A string. Yeah. And you like play like this variation. song is like yeah you got it and then you switch to the D and that one also has a variation with this note here. so the second loop is I fucked up there but <laughs> close enough what a loser. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention the... Uh, hammer on. The hammer on on the chord, like... So, yeah, so then take the, 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 the beginning of the first song, it basically goes like this. basically the chords again, the same chords, but without the variation. So you ready? Yep. Okay, Ish. first verse. Three, four. I spend most of my day sitting in a tiny room alone. It's like a grave without a headstone. Mother's worry that I'm not making any new friends. But she don't know and then it goes into the second verse or pre-chorus and there's a couple of chords there there's the D sharp major except it's the the major 7 variant so it's like this uh, show me please oh you just do the F chord the like F this. chords yeah yeah and then you right finger put it on the second to last string first ah. fret and then you just drum open because it sounds very open. A little bit more airy than this. Almost like dreamlike. It's the 21st century, Andre. Children don't have dreams. 
You got me there. <laughs> D sharp major seven. Moving on to regular D major. And then this shape would be a C, but here it's A sharp major. And then back to G. It's almost like going on a little journey. So one, two, three, four. the transition chord where you do this chord. What is this chord called anyway? Uh, wait, wait a second, what? In the pressed major. We'll find out, find out later. I always call it the transition chord because it's very easy for it to go back to major and minor like. transition from to the first chord. Yeah, the chorus in the chorus is basically G minor, D minor, major, D major, and then D sharp major 7, and then the A sharp major, and then the jazz version of the B major, D major 7. You basically take the major chord uh -huh. and remove this asshole, the middle one of the chord clutter. It gives a very jazzy feeling. So the chorus goes... did in the song, but I like to just hold it like... And then it's back to the opening verse with a variation just... Also, you could also talk in the rhythm pattern before we started this. Oh yeah, yeah. Most of the rhythm pattern is just this. second verse which has like the bouncy chord and then back up to D major and then temporary to D sharp major and back so it's like Second pre chorus is basically the same as the first pre chorus. You can call me a freak of nature all you want. Because this is who I am. I'd rather be diverse than a cog in the machine. And then the please fuck up is just so please fuck up. Why a be? Meanwhile, I'll be. And back to the chorus. <laughs> yeah. Everyone watching, do the chorus together. Three, two, one, let's go! They got these corpses lying six feet on the ground. I know one day I'm gonna let my family down. They got these corpses lying six feet deep. I know that they won't talk about me when I sleep. Fuck! <laughs> you didn't sing loud enough, everyone. Now Santa's dead. <laughs> and then we come to like a, what's it called, like a half bridge, half chorus alternative. You know you're only wasting our time, cause I've got dust to come on my mind. 
It's bad to be dead that I lie Cause I turned my back on the guy And then comes the Kasu part And that's basically the chorus just go from D major to D minor and then into a G major up until a C, C minor. minor yeah so in that second part of the loop it's This section is like another bridge. There's a lot of bridges in this song. And then it just goes back and forth between the C minor to the D minor. So. Oh, I changed all my life. I play with the band. No wonder everyone has a gun in my hand. They'll send me to hell. Another bridge. Now it's a D sharp major, and then A sharp major, F sharp major, D sharp major, A sharp major, and then the D seven. But I'd like to see them suffer. the ending, also known as the sad part. I think that's basically just the chorus, but just track on the chords. It's like No legacy for you. D sharp major, seven. Memories will fade, but at least I'll have this ending. And the end. That's the end of the song. <laughs> and just for fun, and I don't know if you want to play through the entire song from beginning to end. <laughs> do it! We can try. But okay. I, I won't make any promises if I do it correctly, though. Okay, I'll try to stop with the music. Uh, we will stand under the camera and wave the snakes around to be the audience. Fine with me. No. I'll do it then. Great. And one, two, three, four.